Hi, I'm John with Homegrown Cow, and I'm here to tell you about our new insulated shipping solution, the Moo Cube and the Cow Cube, for meat, poultry, and cheese producers. Uh, as you may know, Homegrown Cow helps farmers ship meat and poultry and cheese all over the country. The best solution to do something like that is to use a molded cooler like this one. If you can get a molded cooler affordably near you, that's what I recommend you use. Uh, it just has two pieces, it has excellent thermal retention, the lid should fit snugly, and it should be at least one and a half inches thick. Two inches is preferred. Uh, I would love to be able to send these to you, but if I were to send you these coolers empty, the cost uh, would be rather prohibitive. So we had to come up with a solution that worked like a cooler, but would take up less space when we were shipping it. So the obvious solution, which you may have seen, is available in a lot of places, is, uh, is something like this, which is a box with six styrofoam panels. Uh, this works pretty well, but it does have one flaw, and that is that when the meat is inside the box with the panels, it can push the panels apart, and you want to avoid uh, that because it can cause significant thermal loss. You'd actually be very surprised at the amount of thermal loss that can happen just from a very small gap between these panels. So, in order to avoid the thermal loss, but to uh, be able to send something to you that takes up uh, not very much space, we've come up with this. This is the prototype for the cow cube or the moo cube. It's six panels, just like this one here, uh, but they interlock and fit together just like a cooler. So they have the same thermal retention as a cooler, but they have the practicalities of something that packs flat. And I'm just going to show you how to put this together. You start with one of the uh, top or the bottom pieces, they're identical, they have four grooves in them. And then you find the two side pieces that have two grooves in them like this. And uh, it's very easy, you just slot them together. A kindergartner could do it to make a U like that. Then you find the two other pieces that have no grooves in them, and they slot in the ends here. And this, you'll notice, is actually rectangular. The moo cube and the cow cube, as their name suggests, are cubes. And the cube is the best shape for thermal retention because it has a low surface area. So there we've made our cooler nice and snug and interlocking. Put your meat in here and your uh, dry ice or gel packs. And then put the lid on. And the lid is what really secures it. And then it's ready to go inside a box. The box is included. And the box just helps to protect against the rigors of, of shipping. Tape it up. Put the air bill that Homegrown Care will email you after your order is accepted and have it ready for the carrier to come to your farm and pick it up. Uh, this box is great. It's strong enough to withstand the rigors of shipping. It's reusable and recyclable. It comes in two very practical sizes. The Moo Cube is 14 inches cubed, can hold about 18 pounds of meat and coolant and the cow cube is 18 inches cubed and it can hold up to 65 pounds of meat and coolant which means you only need two cow cubes to ship a quarter beef to somebody. Uh, if you would like to learn more about it please visit www.homegrowncow.com slash cowcube. Thanks.